Hello kids, how are you? I hope you all are good. Today we'll start with a new chapter that is Open Shot Video Editor. So we all have seen movies either on OTTs or in the theatres. So what is movie? Movie or a video is simply a recording of moving images to narrate some type of story. So nowadays we see we have features in our smartphones which can record videos. So after recording the video we just need to edit it through a professional editor software. So open shot video editor is one of them. We'll study about this today. So let's begin with movie open shot video editor and its components adding photos videos and audio files adding files to the timeline applying transition effects adding text saving the project exporting the project so let's just start with the chapter what are you doing, Nikhil? I am creating a movie from pictures of my birthday. Oh, amazing. Can I see how? Yeah. Sure. Movie. People watch movies on a screen or television. Movie or video is a recording of moving images that narrates a story. Movies are recorded using cameras and sound recording equipment. Nowadays, smartphones have options to record videos. After recording, the movie is edited on professional editor software. A video editor is tasked with taking the raw footage shot by a film crew and director and turning it into the final product. This means following an outline, script or short list and assembling the footage into one cohesive video or film. Often in video and film work, there are many camera angels and takes recorded. There are mainly two formats of movies. Real movies. These movies are made using real people and location. Camera is used to shoot these movies. Animation movies. Animated movies are made of a series of still images displayed in a quick sequence. Movies are one in which individual drawings, paintings, or illustrations are photographed frame by frame. Usually, each frame differs slightly from the one preceding it, giving the illusion of movement when frames are projected in rapid succession at 24 frames per second. Editing of movies You must have applied filter in your pictures while taking a shot from Instagram, Snapchat or maybe an inbuilt camera. Just like we can edit the images to enhance them using editing software like Photoshop, PixArt, etc., movies are also edited to add special effects and make them more appealing by using movie editing software. There are several popular software for editing a movie like Final Cut, Microsoft Movie Maker, Apple iMovie, Adobe Premiere, KineMaster, Lightworks, OpenShot, etc. These platforms allow users to take and edit pictures and videos and share them to other social networks. OpenShot Video Editor OpenShot is a free and open-source video editor for Windows, Linux and macOS. The project started in August 2008 by Jonathan Thomas. You can easily combine multiple images, video clips and audio clips into a single file, and then export the combined video to many common video formats. OpenShot is nonlinear editing software, which means that the original file that was taken from your hard drive will be modified in any way. OpenShot creates its own different video file for editing so that if you want, you can create several different movies using the same source file. Follow the link http www.openshot.org to download it and install it on your computer. To open OpenShot in Windows 10, click on Start icon to open Start menu. Scroll to Display OpenShot Video Editor and click on it. The OpenShot app opens. OpenShot window. Title bar. Menu bar. Main toolbar. Filter box. Project files. Function tabs. Edit toolbar. Playhead. Tracks. Preview window. Zoom slider. Ruler. Timeline. 
Adding photos, videos and audio files. Adding photo. Click on import file button or press Ctrl plus F. Import file dialog box appears. Navigate the folder from which you want to add photos. Select the picture that you require. Click on open. The selected image gets added in the project files of OpenShot. Adding video. Click on import file button or press Ctrl plus F. Import file dialog box appears. Navigate the folder from which you want to add video. Select the video that you require. Click on open. The selected video clip gets added in the project files of OpenShot. Adding audio. Click on import file button or press Ctrl plus F. Import file dialog box appears. Navigate the folder from which you want to add audio. Select the audio file that you require. Click on open. The selected audio file gets added in the project files of OpenShot. Adding files to the timeline. Click on the file you want to use in your video. Drag the file to the available track on the timeline. Repeat steps 1 and 2 and drag differ files to the available track on the timeline. After arranging the files on the timeline, you can preview your video looks and sound in the preview window. Click on play button to preview movie along with the music. If you want to rearrange clips, just drag and drop them to move them. Applying transitions effects. Click on Transitions tab. Click on Desired Transition Effect. Drag the transition effect on the timeline and position it to the top of the clip. Click and drag the side of blue transition box to change the duration of the effect. Click on Play button to see the effect works. Transition effect appears in the preview window. Right click on the blue transition effect box to change the direction of the effect. Click on Reverse Transition from the menu that appears. When you click on the play button, you will see the transition effect in the reverse order. Adding text. Click on the title menu. Click on title or press Ctrl plus T. The window appears. Click on the template from choose a template section. From the properties section, change the properties of the text like color and other attributes. The preview window with changes is shown. Click on save button to confirm the changes. Title text that you have saved appears on the project files area. Click on title text file. Drag the text on the timeline and position it on the top of the clip. Click on play button to see a preview of the text in the video. Saving the project. Click on file menu. The file menu appears. Click on save project or press Ctrl plus S. The save project dialog box appears. Click inside the file name text box and type the name for the project. Click on Save button. Your project is saved in OpenShot file format. Exporting the project. Click on File menu. The file menu appears. Click on Export project. Click on Export video or press Ctrl plus E. The Export video dialog box appears. Type file name and folder path for the project. Choose from one of the many preset export options. Click on export video to start the export process. Progress bar displays the progress of exporting the movie. Click on done after the progress bar shows 100%. The file gets exported to the desired file format.